Hello, my dear lovely students and teachers, all of you. I hope you are fine. Today, I'm here to share an amazing math resource with all of you, which is a virtual number line. As we all know that a number line is a line on which there are negative numbers, there are positive numbers with equal intervals. This number line can be used for many purposes in math. We can use it for addition, subtraction, for skip counting, and so on. How to use it? Let me tell you. We can set the range of this number line according to our own choice, according to our own will. As you can see the settings button over here, when I click on the setting button, it is going to show me that which type of numbers I want to see on the number lines. I can select fractions, I can select decimals, I can start, I can uh, choose the starting number by myself. As you can see right now, there are no negative numbers over here, but if I'm going to put a negative number, in the box, they will they will change the number line accordingly. Now see here, I have a number line which is showing negative numbers from minus 10. And then we have positive numbers till 21. And they are so on. If we move for, forward, we will see more. See here. This is a bar which we can use to scroll down the number line. I, I mean scroll horizontally and see the range of the number line. Now where are we going to use it? We have seen in math sums that we have to add we have to add negative or positive numbers, isn't it? This number line will be an excellent resource for the teacher to use in their online lessons. How? There's a writing tool available as well where we can write our equations. For example, I have an equation or I have an expression to solve, which is minus nine or minus eight right now plus six. All right. It means that. I have to start my number, my counting from minus 8, and I have to add 6 to it. This number line also has a pen tool, which I can use to show the students the skip count virtually. Like, we can show that the starting point is minus 8 over here, and then I have to move 6 places forward. Why forward? Since this is a plus sign in between eight, minus 8 and 6, so I'm going to move 6 steps forward. So let's move six steps forward. I'm going to move one, two, and then three, four, five, six. Where did I land it on to? I landed on to minus two over here. So I can write the answer minus two. This is how simple it is to use this number line and understand things so clearly. Let's do another example. I can also change the equation. Let's write another equation. Now I am going to start from a positive number. All right, let's say 9. And then I have to move in the negative numbers. That means 9 minus 6, let's say. All right. I can also change the color of the writing. This is such an amazing resource which can be used, which will be very useful in online lessons as we know since in this pandemic most of us are having online classes so this is a very effective resource which can be used all right now i have nine minus six which means my starting point is nine and i have to jump back six times i'm going to do one two three four five and six okay i deliberately choose this line because i needed to show you that we can choose dotted lines and we can choose solid line as well okay so when we do 9 minus 6 we got the answer of 3 okay so i'm going to write here equals to 3 okay i hope that you people are going to use this number line in your lessons and the students are also going to use this number line to help in their math homeworks and classworks this is definitely going to be very useful for you so I'll be bringing another video very soon with an excellent resource again, just like this one. Stay tuned up till then. All of you take care. Allah Hafiz.